What's cracking, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. When we last left off, we not did that one, but we finished off Sunset Snake Eyes and beat the old mugshot doggy. I figured out a way to get us to Haiti. And it's a good thing you did because that's right where we're going in this episode. So let's get a little bit of background story here. The third member of the Fiendish Five was the infamous voodoo priestess, Ms. Ruby. Born into a family of mystics, other children found her scary. Teaching herself to summon the undead provided what few friends she had. A career in crime allowed an adult Ms. Ruby to punish the world for fearing her as a child. Chief mystic for the Fiendish Five, her powers allowed them to break both the laws of man and nature at the same time. Yet despite the whirlwind success of her youth, she managed to slip into obscurity. Last known sightings claim she headed out of civilization and deep into the Haitian jungle. So that's where we're going, into vicious voodoo. Yikes. That was a doll of me. <clears throat> now, I apologize if, uh... I have to kind of keep backing away from the mic. I am developing a little bit of a cold. You can't hear it in my voice or anything yet, but I was coughing up a storm earlier, so I do apologize if that happens. Sorry, Sly, but this is one mission you will have to accomplish without me. You don't believe in ghosts, do you? Sure I do. My scanners have picked up verifiable paranormal activity. But that's not the problem. This swamp is oozing with disgusting mold and bacteria. Suck it up, Bentley. Oh we got my work to gosh. Do. All right, then. Don't forget to use the new move you learned from Mugshot section of the Thievius Raccoonus. You mean the Raccoon Railwalk? The roots and vines oh, yeah. are perfect for that. All you gotta do is jump and hit the circle button. Especially where you see the bark has been worn away. And we're in super slick from Mickey Slime and Moss. You'll <laughs> rail slide like a skater grinding pipe. I'm like Sweet. It. Well, let's go ahead and hit it up. Uh, or I'll just walk along it. I don't really know how that works. Okay, whatever. Make sure to get this uh, bottle over here before anything. And I'll try to grab this one on top of this guy's head. There we go. All right, so let's jump up here, grab on, and let's start grinding. I'm going to go backwards because I don't give a shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, I made it. I'm good. I don't care. Now, I think... Yeah, there's definitely something down there. Right below me. But I don't really know how I want to go about... Oh, get out of here, buddy. Okay, it is like a rail of some sort. But I don't see any other purpose to it. Unless it goes behind that. Hmm. I have no idea. Let's just kind of check this out. Okay, circle does not work. Good thing I have that water capability now. Haha, <laughs> right? Uh, there we go. Now he jumped on it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Perfect. So, let's get back on the rail and moving on. Uh-oh. Watch out for these freaking spiders, though. I don't know what their attack is. And if you hear any uh, crunching or anything like that in the background, that is Sydney's dog chewing on a bone. Sorry about that. I'm kind of babysitting while recording. Uh, looks like I gotta go around to get in there, but... Uh, I just want the bottle! Maybe I can reach? Since, I, since I've got uh, such great abilities to jump back out of water now. Uh, I don't think I can reach it from over here anyway. So I might have to go all the way around. So, let's just do that. 
I'll go ahead and go up here. Don't have to go that way. Yikes, almost missed that. Hmm. I don't see anywhere else to go that way, so I'm just going to head over here. We're going to go behind this waterfall over to the part where I tried to skip to before. We got for the freaking spider. Oh no, how far back does this take me then? Oh, okay. That's not bad at all. I'm not even freaking worried about that. Falling in the water is no big deal now. Oh! Well, that was a little bit not so rough. I was wondering if I was... Like, I knew I was going to have to attack it, but I didn't know it was going to come alive. Like these guys! Mm, ah, sucker. Ooh, ooh, ah! Freaking too easy for me. Let's grab these three bottles over here. Run over and grab an extra hit! Where we're back at our gold status now. And... We have to... That's where we came up. Oh, don't forget this one. Ooh, could have been bad news. I'm gonna guess we have to go from here over to here. So, looks like it. And this guy's like a freaking watchdog with a light up there. So I'm just gonna go over here and grab this bottle real quick while he's not looking. I can't get up there. So I gotta go back on the left side. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so I'm gonna have to hit him while he's not looking. Uh-oh. I missed that. How do we do this? Come on now. Oopsies, I did mean to. Let's move over. Let's move over. What the heck? Uh, okay. Oh, I have to walk all the way over to the right. I didn't know that. Jeez, I shouldn't have even got hit there. Gosh darn it, don't make it look like I can attack him if I can't. Alright, let's pick that bottle up while we're up here, because we don't want to miss anything and have to go back. No puppy. Sit. Sit. Good girl. Alright. So. Let's just... Okay, never mind. We're gonna... To get in, you'll need that key on top of the tiki pedestal in the guard compound. There's a bad mojo force field protecting it. So you'll have to destroy all five of the purple candles surrounding it. No nope. Sounds easy enough. Don't get cocky or you'll end up with your head shrunk to the size of a pea. You've got to get past those voodoo guards, and I'm warning you, they're made and they work like a team. So do we, buddy. I only see one, though. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drop a mine down there. And I'm just going to let him walk over it. Oh, there's more of them. So I'm not too worried about them. Any game you take your time, you should be just fine. So let's go, and where are you going to walk through? Okay. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I keep trying to turn my camera with the R button. Uh-oh, uh-oh, let's get out of here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay. And boom, got him too. Not only did I get him, but I got a candle. All right, let's throw a hat down right here. We're going to wait for that guy to come back around. And he's going to get blown up right on that hat. Bam! Heck yeah, just like that. I'm going to walk over here and pick all these up because he dropped a ton. Alright. Now, grab that bottle. Let's grab some more coins because we need to get back up to our gold status. Alright, let's watch this guy. What's he doing here? What's he doing? Just walking around this hideout here. I'm not even going to freaking take my time with you anymore. Where's my dive? Right there. 
Couldn't even reach the dang bottle. Okay. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Ugh! He doesn't even turn around like the other guards. I don't understand. Alright. We got, what, one left? Ooh. Sneaky, sneaky, eh? See you later. So let's pick off the rest of these candles. One over here. Did I get it? Oh, last one's over here. Let's swipe it. You've done it! The Mojo Force Field is down! And pick up the dang key before... Bentley can finish babbling on about whatever, you majiggers. <clears throat> Alright, so... How many bottles do I have? 20 out of 20. Perfect, that means we can go over here. Yeah, press O to enter. And... If I did my math right, and I always do my math right, then the combination has got to be 588. Roger, 5... 8... 8... Whoa! It opened! Oh my goodness! <clears throat> oh, my throat. Yikes! It's better now. Kelly Electrifying. Knows on how to harness the electromagnetic field created by a rolling raccoon. Oh, now so now my rolling can attack people. A punch. Plus, it should give you a nice tingling sensation. Ooh. I'm down with that. Let me just put this mask here and I will be on my way. You guys enjoy that. Keep it forever and ever. So, there we've got a roll move. We can just probably roll into whoever the hell we want now. I... Oh, duh, I didn't miss any bottles. I just picked them all up and opened the vault. So there we go, let's move on to the next section of this... Uh, what you wanna call her? The Swamp's Dark Center, My paranormal eh? scanner is maxing out on that structure! A reading like that could only be coming off Ms. Ruby herself. I think you're right, Sly. If you want to crack at Ms. Ruby, you're going to have to find a way inside that skull temple. Okay. Well, I think I can do that. Let's grind on here like it's a freaking Saturday night. Yikes. I don't even know what the hell she's singing. I don't know why it did that. It took all my momentum away. Alright, it's only been... Uh, 13 minutes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and play a level. Uh, I'm not sure why I went back. I don't really know. Don't ask me. I didn't think that it was going back. Sorry. So, so sorry. Okay. So... Let's try out this roll right into this guy. Bam! See you later, sucker. Ha ha. Ha ha. Ha So that's what the new electric roll can do. And uh, that's really great. And there's like a dead turtle up here or something. What the hell? What's... Where does this take me? Oh, I can jump on here, can't I? Yep. So there we go. How do I surprise this guy? I don't think there's a way I can do it. Aha! Uh -huh. I'll just go around this way. And... Yeah. See you later. So let's go in here. This is going to be a little bit of a longer episode, probably. Just because these are going to take somewhat of a longer time. <clears throat> and let's run through this bush. Ooh, what the hell? Oh, we can, we can attack ghosts, I guess. And let's make our way down here. Might as well pick up this bottle on the way, huh? Sounds like a good idea to me. Sly, you'd better be on your guard here. My paranormal scanners show this place is really haunted. Okay, whatever. 
That's the first time that guy's hit me. I guess maybe I should jump next time. Ooh, ooh. So I gotta break those things so the ghost can't come out anymore, huh? Ugh, and I landed on your fucking head on the ground. Fuck off, dude. Maybe if you smash them all, you'd be safe. All right, well, I'll try to do what I can. All right, let's pick this uh, checkpoint up. And I can't break these skulls open. But I did just get another hit, which is great. Look out for the mosquito. Let's open this for another two bottles. We've got 40 to collect in this level, so we better get started. Yikes. Bam! Get out of here! Ah! Get away from me! Ugh. Get away! See, that's how it should go. But, for some reason, I couldn't freaking hit him. Alright. Let's go into the mouth of the beast. Find out what kind of ghosts are waiting for us in here. I right, just passed a bottle. I need to go back for that, but I'm going to get the ghosts first. There we go. So let's pick this up here. Don't forget that one, because you will regret having to go all the way back. Okay, let's jump on here. Oh, let's not jump on there. I just saw the fire go away from the other one. All right. Here we go. And we're fine. This looks like some sort of arena, though. That's not good. Uh, do I still have my roll? I do. Let's just do that. Who wants to go bowling, boys? Bam, suckers. You guys didn't see that coming, did you? I've got new abilities. I'm freaking unstoppable. Okay, that's not true. I've been hit so many times since I've been here. But let's jump up this buggle drum and find out what's on the left. What is on the left? Oh, there was an extra life on the right. Oh, looks like we have to go back to the right anyway. Because there's a bunch of bottles over here and that's about it. So, we're almost halfway with those. Let's go ahead. I'm just going to jump down and jump to the right. So it'll be a little bit quicker. Oh, we got to follow these lasers, eh? Hopefully there were no bottles on the other side. That will make me very sad. Doesn't look like it. Sounds like Sydney's here, though. What is that? Oh, that's on the other side. Okay. And here we go. Ooh, and it's a tilty platform. Great. Okay, let's jump up on here. There we go, there we go, there we go. Alright, let's get rid of all that crap. Hey there, honey. It's okay. And that was Sydney coming home for a lunch break. Alright, now we're halfway. Making good progress, I'd say. And we're gonna jump between all these dead, toasted turtles. It's my favorite cereal. Ugh. Get away from me, head. Get away from me, head. That's what I'm talking about. Get away, Skeeter. Doug's friend, Skeeter. Oh, don't forget that secret hidden bottle up there. They're being jerks about everything, it seems like. Can I go, just go this way now? It looks like I can. Because I'm going to go over here, grab three bottles off this guy's face. And what's down there? Can I, can I go down this way? Nope. It ends right there. It does not let me stay on it. So I'm just going to assume I need to go back then. Let's run over this way then. Good deal. Let's jump on here and wait for the fire to go down. Perfect. And there we go. It's a little bit quicker on that one. And they're starting to group up the bottles, so hopefully that means we're getting towards the end of the level. Look out for ghosts. And what are they? Like freaking cats? Or like uh, panthers or something, like a like a puma. Alright. So we've got a safe over here, holy moly. Pick up two bottles out of there, it looks like. Get all these Doug's friends out of here. Skeeter! And this isn't a grind one, so I can jump off and grab this real quick. I just want to see. Oh, great. Where are, the, where are you coming from? What the H? Get off. 
Damn. Damn. There's one ghost left. There you are. All right. So I didn't know that you could actually, like, hit ghosts. You must have, like, a super special uh, cane there. 35 out of 40. We are closing in on the end of this level. It looks like... Ooh, ooh, ooh. So many freaking ghosts. Yeah, we've got a bottle back here. And then there are two... Uh, I want to say chests over this way. Let's go pick those up. Uh, safes, I guess. There we go. So now we got 40 out of 40. Let's jump on this. Get our upgrade. Okay, okay. This is kind of a guess, but try one, two, eight. Why are you guessing, man? I can't deal with a guess. Oh, God. You're lucky. Almost fired you. All right. Ah, a more modern entry. Bruce O'Koop's computer hacking technique. Using the data hmm. on this page, I should be able to tap the duty roster at each hideout and project guard information into your binoculum. Uh, what? So that does what? I do not understand why I would want that. But okay, that's great. We unlocked a new ability. So there's our second key. And that's about it for today's episode. Because we're at 22 minutes. So next time we will be heading into some other dark portal of sorts. Now... Hmm. I don't see anything. But whatevs. Anyways. I don't think we can go through this yet. Oh. So that's basically what it's telling me. Alright. Well, there you have it. Uh. What we're going to do is next time probably go through some of these other levels and then we will unlock probably the next area and continue through that. So, thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the episode and I hope you turn in next time. Bye everybody.